kufuata uh, ni binti mdogo tu kabisa ila anapenda ku kuwa public speaker nadhani anafuata nyayo za babake babake anafanya public speaker kwa hiyo binti akaniambia na mimi nataka kuja kuzungumza hapo na I was very much inspired with that kwa sababu ni binti mdogo lakini ana story nzuri ya kushare na sisi topic yake yeye ni how to conquer the battle within. Unajua ilivyo kuna vitu vinakuwa vinakuzuia zoea kufanya vitu. Kama umeamka asubuhi si niende tani au si si siende. Si ni mkubali yuko jana si ni mkataa. Yaani vitu vinakuwekwa sana. Una unakuwa una, unaenda mbele unarudi nyuma unaenda mbele unarudi nyuma sasa watu wengi na inawapa shida. Hiyo ni topic ndefu kweli kweli hiyo ya kuweza kuwini huko ndani. Yaani ni ndio tunakwambia nimeacha pole. Baada ya muda tu ha huyo anaanza tena huko. Yes. Anamwambia nimeokoka. Baada ukiangalia anachokifanya mbona na walokola wafanye? Kwa you can see it's very very difficult. Kwa hiyo ni binti mdogo naomba tu mtu makofi makubwa, kumpa confidence. Yeah, naitwa Anaitwa Jade Nikasere. Yo. You have greatness within you. You have greatness within you. Then I want me you have greatness within you. See us Social media na enyewe 
kuposti posti kutaka kuwa kama mtu fulani ukanipoteza lengo kuu ambao kwa nini nimechagua psychology so nikamwambia mama mama i want to postpone walishtuka kuliwaka manti vikao kila mmoja ananiita huyu amechangikiwa kuna nini nafsi yake imechukuliwa <laughs> kwa hiyo <laughs> unaweza ukaona picha nilio niliyokuwa napata mzunguko wa mawazo kama kijana mdogo unaamua kufanya maamuzi fulani ili ujitafute na watu wanakushambulia what the only thing that enabled me to be calm to all that situation ni kutuliza akili na hicho ndio kitu ambacho naenda kuongelea leo there are voices that affect how we run our daily activities they may be coming from outside or they may be coming from inside so far mimi hapa nilikuwa na voices ambazo zina come from outside no maana ni postpone mwaka nisimamishe maneno ambayo watu walikuwa wananiambia kwamba psychology nini na nini kwa hiyo kama nisimamishe hapo na pia sasa nipo nipo kwa nipo kwenye harakati za za kusimama mwenyewe kama kijana inside voices are also affecting you and they may be affecting you also kuna wakati unaweza kufanya maamuzi magumu na nafsi yako ya ndani inapingana na wewe You want to do this it's telling you hapana acha. Unataka ukafanye mazoezi gym mwaka mpya umeanza. Wengine wanataka kufanya fitness. Nini gym umejaa? Wewe tulia lala tu ndani. Yaani that's the inner voice. Hapo hujamshirikisha ndugu, hujamshirikisha rafiki, lakini ndani yako mwenyewe kuna kitu kinakwambia no. You know our brain is there to tell you that you should be comfortable. But you are the only one who can remind your brain who is in control. If you don't remind your brain who is in control, life will keep happening to you. Things will keep happening to you. Utasikia leo twende wapi? Twende um twende Savannah Street, kwenye Savannah Street kafanye nini lakini utaenda kwa sababu gani? You want to be appreciated appreciated by other people. But you did not appreciate yourself in the first place. And so also these voices they can make, they can give you evidence why you don't deserve love why you don't deserve good health why you don't deserve a good partner these voices are there inside and out a friend of mine asked me how i maintain positivity baada ya kupostpone mwaka nika ni ni kabla ya kupostpone mwaka nilikuwa nimeenda field baada ya mwaka wa kwanza nikaenda nikaenda field kwa wakati fulani ndio nikakutana patient nilikuwa patient wa clinic tukao tunaongea akanielezea kuhusu maisha yake na nini tukapeana namba baada tu kwa important mpaka leo na sasa kila kinsalimia anaona niko positive unaona na unaponiona anapoongea anajitahidi kuongea yani ina ina way ambayo you can smile kidogo naona binti amesmile asante sana <laughs> and so And you is a job in how you able to maintain positivity all the time. Nikamwambia flani tumite John. John. Mimi kiamka asubuhi kwa kweli. Ninaamka asubuhi nikijua kwamba there's a battle every day. Naamka asubuhi nikijua kwamba nisipojikumbusha kwamba mimi hapa ninaweza kitu flani. Then mtu mwingine akija kuniambia siwezi nitakubaliana naye. There's a battle within myself that i have to conquer every day if i don't do it if i don't do it for myself no one is going to do it for me nikamuuliza john wewe vipi je ukiamka asubuhi unajiambiaje yani ukiamka asubuhi what do you tell yourself akaniambia i wake up every day in the morning knowing people are very me so i have to be me na kwa kweli na I want to mimi hiyo message nilikuwa nimeenda uh, katika contest plan nikasema sim kabisa sikutaka that negativity in my life kwa sababu I postponed my year to cut myself from friends who push me uh, who will bring me backwards and not push me forward in that sentence you need to so he wakes up in the morning thinking that I have to be mean so that I can achieve anything I have to be mean watu wako kwa ajili ya kunyanyasa nini can you imagine the emotions anazoamkanazo kila asubuhi kwamba watu ni wabaya kwake 
Kwa kila mtu aki, aki, yani ina maisha hata kikanyago na mtu kwenye dadaa anaweza kanimosha kabisa kwa kibao. Kwa sababu gani? Huku ndani ya kujatuhia thinking alio nayo inamleta nyuma haipeleki mbele. That type of mentality alionao mentality alionao John ina inafanya yeye asibuild positive relationships. He builds unhealthy relationships with himself and with others. Dear friends, it's important to be aware of our thoughts for they either lead to negative or positive emotions. Kama ni kusema mwatu. Psychology, tunajua kwamba, tukifundisha darasa, tunambia kwamba, negative thinking leads to negative emotions that leads to negative, I mean, abnormal behavior. That means the actions that a person with a negative type of mindset is taking will bring him backwards and not towards his goals. So, katika harakati yangu kujitafuta na ku fight easy battles, the only way ni muona conquer these thoughts is through opposition thinking. Our brains can hold one thought at a time. And so you can practice opposition <coughs> thinking, whereby when a negative, you have to understand that when a negative thought comes, you can irreplace it with a positive thought. Just as the way the negative thought in Mekuja, unenzo kai replace na nini? Na positive thought. Kwa mfano. Suez kongia na watu. Pale pale, ukishe, sikia yu sauti na kwambia, you can't do this. Suez kongia na watu. Pale pale, I can do it. I can talk to people. I should do it. It's for myself. It's not for them. So you need yani unaanza kujipump mwenyewe. Kwa sababu usipojipump mwenyewe ndugu yangu, hapa mbele utapaona pagumu. Mimi nilikuwa napaona hapa pagumu. Unaona mwanzo ni kwanza mdomo wacha, ninacheza cheza kidogo lakini sasa unaona nimetulia, nimefurahi sana. Naomba mnipigie makofi. The second thing that you have to know is you have to keep your mind healthy. Sasa ni postpone mwaka lakini sitaki kukaa idle, si ndivyo? Natakia ni keep busy. How do you keep yourself busy? Is it through uh, visiting people or is it through reading books? It's very important how you feed your mind. You think you feed your mind with the right information or negative information. Currently, I feed my mind with social media, mostly YouTube. Yes, I listen to a lot of YouTube videos and Kuna mdada mmoja na ito Lisa Nicole na mpenda sana. Yeye, alikuwa broke na broken. Unelea mana nubo sema broke na broken. Alikuwa broke mana kwamba hakuwa na hela ya kutosha. Na alikuwa na mtoto na itaji kumlea. And she was broken kwa sababu humu ndani hapa kuwa na kitu. She was dead inside. What did she decide to do? She told her child, Pala nukwa hivuona, anashina di kumulia pampers. And she was so broke in such a way, ayikuwa anashina di kumulia mtu wake pampers. Kamuambia, nesau jina atoto. Akamuambia, akamuambia, jelani. Jelani. What did he, what did she say? She was saying from the small that you were hana kwa mba kwa mbalisha. Alikuwa mba mbalisha taulo. Baada ya kumulamisha. So akawa mekaa, kasima, don't worry, Jalan. We are never going to be this broke ever again. Now, for Kamo, I'm so bad. I'm sure I can my child will not live the life I'm born to my issue. Say, yes, who are Kayona and my issue? Yes, so she decided herself to take control of her life. Cindy. And what did she do? The first thing she do, she had to change her mindset. Na alifanya kwa kutumia neuro-linguistic programming. Sige nge in deep what that is, I think alikuwa na di affirm kila siku kwa mba, I'm proud of you, Lisa. Yes, you're going through this and this and this, but I'm proud of you because of this and this and this. Akasema, I forgive you, Lisa. Yes, you can't buy papers, you can't afford this or that. Lakini, you're doing your best you can. Chetatu akana jambia, I commit to you, Lisa. You will wake up every day on time. You will do this and this and this. Your child is waiting for you to achieve uh, some 
basic needs, eating, providing for him. And so that's what I'm talking about. You have to keep your mind healthy. You have to train yourself by doing opposition thinking. When you wake up in the morning, try to remind yourself. That's what the brain does. The other thing that you can do to alleviate the battles that are ongoing in your mind is exercises. Exercises are very good. So we're going to help to clear your thoughts. Alafu kuna chemical na kwa release from the brain. Pali ambapo na kufanya mazwezi. Or it makes you feel happier and more joyful. Ukishindo ayo, basi meditation. What is meditation? This is a relaxation exercise whereby you focus on breathing. Wangapi mmeshai ku meditate? Sasa, you kama mgependa, mgependa to exercise kidogo what meditation is. Do you allow me to meditate with you guys? Yes. <laughs> How does it feel? To not think about anything but just that umepewa uhai, unafumua, unapewa second chance. Kila unapofumua, unapewa second chance to go forward, to make an action, 
that will either change your <laughs> own life or even your family's life or the people that you love generally. So in closing, guess life will keep happening. It will keep on moving, it may keep on being challenging. Tomorrow maybe we'll be